Hello YouTubers. Um, this is uh, how I put wheel bearings in uh, hubs, the, the replaceable kind, like that. It's only like 20 bucks on eBay for the bearing, but it's a lot more work than just replacing a, a whole hub bearing assembly with the bearing in there. Okay, now, this part here was in the oven for an hour and a half at 450. This was in the freezer overnight, as you can tell, it's got uh, stuff on. Now watch. Drops right in, okay? Now, I'm gonna cool it off so it don't burn the grease out of the bearing. That little bit of water is not going to hurt nothing inside the bearing, but you got to cool it off. You don't want to melt the grease out of the bearing, so then you'll just be back to square one. Okay, of course you're going to use welding gloves and a pair of vice grips to carry it out of the oven. And that's how you do that. Now all you have to do is put the snap ring in. Now of course this only works with the bearings that are replaceable. This is out of a 99 Elantra. Uh, a lot of the newer cars, they don't have the replaceable bearing. But just go on Advance Auto if you want to know what kind you have and see if they sell the bearing separately, which means it's replaceable. And if they only sell the hub, then of course it's not replaceable. <coughs> okay, hope this helps. I know it saves me a lot of time. And it saves the bearing too, because sometimes if you got to press it in, if you don't do it right, you're going to mess up the ball bearings or the roller bearings in there when you do it. Okay? Alright. Have a good one.